when a woman has sex with a man, she tends to emotionally get more connected and attached to this particular man. However, when it comes to men, it is the total opposite, okay? In fact, that is why most times before a man succeeds in sleeping with a particular woman, he is more than willing to do all it takes to get this woman. So the love will be there, the attention will be there, the care will be there, the gift will be there. But immediately this guy succeeds in sleeping with this woman, then oh boy, the chapter will be closed. Now in today's video, gentlemen, I'm going to be giving you some of the kinds of women that you should never ever have SEX with. Now I'll also go further to give you the reasons why I strongly discourage you sleeping or having sex with these particular women. This is the men's love zone. You are welcome. My name is Pam Oi, aka GCP, and make sure to watch this video up until the end. <laughs> The very first kind of woman you should never ever sleep with is a total stranger. <laughs> now, gentlemen, I understand that you guys love exploring, okay? You love doing check, 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 my quad too. <laughs> So today you'll have SAX with a tall cheek, tomorrow you want a short one, the next day you want a light-skinned one, the other day you want a dark one, the other day you want a slim one, and the other day you want one with a big bam bam. Okay, now I understand, but my brother, when you sleep with a total stranger, first of all, you need to understand that you are endangering your life to lots of things, okay? Things like HIV, things like STDs, things like... um spiritual connection because you also need to understand that sex is not just physical but it's also spiritual yeah so each time you continue having sex with lots of women in the spiritual world it's the same thing now that's other times that you realize they are women that you sleep with and out of the blue you realize that things are not working yeah probably you had just gotten this job and then you sleep with this woman and before you know it the job is gone or you get to sleep with this man and before you know it uh, the business is no longer moving you get into an accident i mean you get lots and lots of misfortunes it's because sex is spiritual so the next time you think of sleeping with a stranger please think twice and also we all know that these days the population of the women is way bigger than that of the men so instead of you know rushing to sleep with a stranger how about you get to know this lady you know spend some time and when you feel the time is right then you can get down to business with her so number one never have sex with a total stranger it's the number two kind of woman that i wouldn't encourage you to sleep with is the jumpy and loose kind of woman okay now we all know that women will get attracted to other men or women will get tempted to have sex with other men for certain reasons okay it could be that her man cannot satisfy her in bed it could be that her man cannot fully take responsibility or cannot fully cater for this woman financially okay so those are some of the situation or cases where women will easily cheat now, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about this woman who naturally is the jumpy kind of woman, yeah? So even if you know very well that you satisfy her in bed, even when you know that you can try as much as possible to spend time with her, even when you know that you try as much as possible to support her financially, but still you realize that she easily cheats on you, then bro, mm -mm, that is not the kind of woman I would advise you to sleep with, yeah? Now, there are also women who are well-known, say it's maybe a small town, and everyone talks about them. I mean, even when they pass on the street, they're like, mm, that one would sleep with literally anything that is called a man, yeah? So when you hear this kind of gossip, this kind of rumors about this particular woman, bro, I wouldn't encourage you to sleep with that kind of woman. Just let her go. Mm. Next, mm. Next, third kind of woman that I wouldn't advise you to sleep with is an older woman okay now it's different if you are all adults say um the man is let's say 35 and the lady is 40 that is kind of understandable but i'm referring to cases whereby the man is just say 20 23 25 and this lady is 50 
Come on. <laughs> now that is a very, very big difference. That is a very big age difference, yeah? Now I know most men these days will be forced to get into this kind of relationship because of materialistic things, because of wealth, or probably there's this older woman in office that has the powers to promote him. So he would easily give in to this older woman. Now, the problem or the challenge with being in this kind of relationship is that most times it will be very hard for you to get out of it. I mean, it reaches a point whereby this older woman will literally own you. She will literally control you and it will be very hard for you to move on. It will be very hard for you to get into another normal kind of relationship. So I wouldn't advise you to get into that kind of relationship or to sleep with that kind of a woman. That has been woman type number. The fourth kind of woman I wouldn't encourage you to sleep with is one who has a smelly juicy part. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Now, gentlemen, you need to understand that naturally, a woman's juicy pot is supposed to smell like juicy pot. I mean, naturally, yeah? So don't expect a woman's juicy pot to, to smell like some kind of candy, some kind of ice cream, some kind of chicken. Mm, of course, a juicy pot will not smell like something else. It has to smell like natural juicy pot. And a natural juicy pot is supposed to have a natural kind of scent. You know, that scent that is like, flesh yeah like not really meat but just some kind of flesh something that is natural you get but when you have a woman who has a scent that is kind of fish yeah something that smells like fish or something that's that smells like say a rotten egg then mm, that means your woman has a problem now the reason why i wouldn't encourage you to sleep with this kind of women is that these days all of us are so so into oral sex yeah so just imagine you are with this woman, she has that bad scent, which obviously meanwhile means that she has infection, yeah? So when it comes to you giving her oral, just imagine you are going to force yourself to start licking that kind of smelly juice pot. So if your woman has a smelly juicy pot, I would advise that you either talk to her, encourage her to go for medication, and if it's someone that is random. I mean, someone that you are just having X A X with, then I would encourage you to just strip it off and call it quits. Okay. The last kind of woman I wouldn't encourage you to have X A X with is a woman who is so 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 much interested in money. Okay. Now. I understand that all women love money. In fact, you might ask me and be like, Pam, is there any single woman in this world who doesn't love money? And of course, my answer is no. All women love money. However, that is a difference in the weight or in the frequency that women love money, okay? So there are these particular women who would be in a relationship with you strictly for the money, strictly for what she's benefiting from you, strictly for... The gifts and that is it but each time you are not able to give her money each time you are not able to take her to these expensive trips each time you are not able to finance her rent and then she'll end the relationship or she'll move to the next door that is what i am talking about okay so if you have this woman who you know wakes up in the morning she goes to work but then once in a while she'll request you for money it is different yeah so if you really really have this woman who makes it so obvious that your relationship is only centered about money when she calls you to meet up the first question is like please don't forget to come with this amount of money for me yeah when you tell her you know what babe i want us to go for a trip over the weekend she's like how much are you giving me send transport send this send this i mean it's always about money then bro you cannot be in that kind of relationship especially if you are looking for a serious relationship maybe if you are someone who just wants to have fun well and good but if you are into a serious relationship i wouldn't encourage you to be with that kind of woman well guys thank you so much for watching those have been the points that i wanted to share with you today those are the five kinds of women i wouldn't encourage you to have sex with thank
Thank you for watching. And before you get off this video, please, if you found this to be interesting, valuable, helpful in any way, how about you support this channel by subscribing? Don't forget to turn on the bell notification so that each time I post, you will be notified just like that, okay? And before you get off, please give this video a thumbs up if you found value in it. Don't forget to leave a comment. Let me know what you think about this point. And above all, please share this video with your friends and family because when you do that, you actually help my channel to grow. Thank you once again. I love you. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>